let's get into our talkers for today. So 7-Eleven, we're talking about it again. Uh, they're coming clean about what proved to be a very clever April Fool's prank. So do you remember when we talked about uh, it coming out with uh, sparkling water flavors and one of the flavors was like dog, hot dog water? And I was like, no, 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 not for me. Well, it turns out that was actually a prank, okay? They were actually really sneaky about it, introducing the products not on April 1st, but several days ahead of April 1st or April Fool's Day. Uh, they also tucked the Big Bite Hot Dog Sparkling Water announcement in with a broader announcement about uh, several new sparkling water flavors, which actually is happening. But while the hot dog sparkling water was a joke, uh, of course, the company has said that uh, fans actually were interested in it, probably trying to figure out where they can get hot dog water from as a, as a prank for April Fool's Day. Joke's on us. All right, moving on. You may not find a pot of gold, but seeing a rainbow is a kind of reward in itself. Uh, today, April 3rd, is a day to celebrate these colorful rays of hope. It's natural, national. Find a rainbow day. So in Irish mythology, leprechauns hid their treasures at the end of a rainbow, and that's a trick uh, since rainbows can only be seen at a distance. You can never actually reach the end. Now. The stunning aerial displays are formed when sunlight passes through the water droplets in the atmosphere, but you don't have to wait to, for the rain, even though it is raining today, uh, to enjoy the beauty. Young scientists can create rainbows of their own with garden hose. You know, I don't understand why April 3rd is Rainbow Day when March 17th was St. Patrick's Day. They should join the two somehow, some way. I'm just saying. All right, moving on. Here's a question for you at home. Do you have a mountain of clutter at home that you're dreading dealing with. Well, our new research says you're not alone if you are. It's conducted by one poll. 40% of homeowners are afraid of facing the clutter in their home, although 80% consider themselves to be organized. Nearly half of the people say organization of their homes has an impact on their mental health, with 80% saying they feel more motivated when their home isn't cluttered. My mom always says a cluttered room or home is a cluttered mind. She's a neat freak, so she agrees with this. So uh, what are the top items that clutter our storage places? We'll take a look at your screen. Home and holiday decor, old documents, clothes, shoes, small tools, even cleaning supplies. Well, cleaning supplies is at the bottom of the list, but it should be at the top. I'm just saying. All right, those are your talkers for today. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.